now we are going to see live SQL injection so see this this is a website wurtv.wur.nl I will spider this website so I already spider you have to spider this website see this I already spider why we have to spider because we have to get some parameters I got lots of parameter these many parameters you have to test for SQL injection so see <clears throat> let's turn the first link right click send this to repeater repeater so there are how many parameters there are this action parameter date time parameter end time end date parameter filter status so I'll try first the post parameter then I will try on gate parameter so see this let's click on go normally first I got response this is a response okay now if now there's a first parameter is group key if I'm giving here a backslash see what happened uh, you are getting something yes the backslash is giving lots of thing yes the error thing yes okay now instead of backslash just give single quote to check it's one level or not so when I gave backslash single quote I got something see this incorrect SQL syntax error near whatever question mark after the character string so this is vulnerable this is a SQL syntax now try to fix this so if I'm trying single quote space and space let's give something uh, a equal to a let's try this now so see it's fixing yes we have fixed now correctly now now you will have two options either you try manually or either you try automation both acceptable okay so if I'm trying out through automation see this instead of single quote I have just give a star there a star means SQL map will identify the parameter through star value I'll copy this copy to file I will save this into SQL map folder okay I'll save like as a wur.txt okay now now the first command will be what see there is a wur.txt see this so I have to attack I have to load this request into SQL map for this I will use python SQL map dot py because this is a post based with a hyphen r and the file name wur.txt space hyphen hyphen badge hyphen hyphen banner let's wait so I got this there is a error based SQL injections and the banner we successfully grabbed the banner that they are using Microsoft SQL server if you want database you can give hyphen hyphen dbs see you got database details all the database you can even give, go into any let's go in this way database you get hyphen capital d the first one b e h e e r tool space hyphen hyphen tables okay so we are not getting any tables so no problem okay try on any other if you are trying for a master or msd let's hyphen capital d ms db space hyphen hyphen tables see this you are getting tables detail that backup file back oh my god restore file so i'm not going further okay this will be the the bridge okay so i'm just leaving log okay so i'm going to report this right now so you won't miss you this vulnerability so what I will do, I will make a uh, no, report format that is vulnerability name is what cross site scripting oh, sorry not cross site scripting it's a SQL injection now vulnerability 
description I will use what uh, you can use you can I will copy from Google okay no problem one day while URL one day while URL okay let's copy from the Bob suit right click copy URL now nah. vulnerable p parameter so vulnerable parameter is what uh, this so advanced search okay it's a group key okay so I'll give group key JSON parameter group key now nah. payload you can use single code to identify the vulnerability now how to reproduce this vulnerability this is a very good section you have to make this sections how to reproduce this vulnerability one see this now one see I can do one thing for a hyphen hyphen dbs hyphen capital V and 5 I will do okay small b5 okay so yes so on group key someone tried this and you got what pop up so someone tried what this on group key someone tried this now so I will use same thing there so if you are trying this what will happen let's click on copy this now see this if I'm trying this here let's click on go what you are getting you are getting uh, something there the subject error parameters null start in DB this is a vulnerable okay in the uh, conversion failed when converting into varchar see this now you have to give exact steps where they can enumerate this so let's use this now if you are doing hyphen hyphen tables hyphen v3 see so this way you are getting tables and other things okay yeah hell lots of tables so if you are trying this now let's copy this now so see this if someone will try this let's copy this now this payload oh man if so if I will copy this let's copy this if you will try there what will happen see you are getting the database name of behar tool so I will just say that do one thing yes so I'll say how to reproduce this vulnerability for this uh, set JSON parameter group key to what this what we have copied this yes to this it will give you database name and the database name may be what this
that is this so you have to give the steps so they can reproduce these okay otherwise it won't confirm the way otherwise they will reject this vulnerability so now third third steps is okay the POC what's the proof of concept so I'll give a request body in the case of SQL injections I'll give a request body so request body is this and the response body okay that screenshot enclosed in attachment I can say yes yes see this and yes now see this uh, so I will take a screenshot of this vulnerability so I will highlight this okay and as well as I will highlight this okay now shift control for so I am taking a screenshot okay done yes as well as I will take a screenshot of the database list so shift control 4 so see this I run this and I got the database that's it that's it so it's a complete report now okay so now I will report this to where it's a search vulnerability so let's go to gmail I'll use this gmail now I'll send this mail to short and it's a short at the rate NCC regarding critical vulnerability report hashtag so I'm using the numbers for reporting so I last I reported 135 number 136 yes 136 so this time I will report 137 and just I will paste this report now this is a screenshots I have to attach yes I think it's done now let's click on send so this way you have to report you have to hunt so I hope it's clear to you if not we will have a discussion session over slack or over Udemy thank you